Good afternoon guys. It's me, Zara, back with another video. So, um, I'm so sorry that this video is going to be up like a day late. This didn't age well because that day turned into a week. But I literally, like, haven't had any time to record anything this weekend. And I've been so stuck for ideas of, like, what to do. Because I didn't want to do, like, another sit-down chat video again. I wanted to do something more active. So it's going to be a little hungover vlog today because I went out last night. You can probably tell that I'm not looking or sounding my best. And that is why I'm starting this vlog in the afternoon and not the morning because... I woke up, I woke up about like an hour and a half ago. It's like half 12, quarter to one right now. Um, and I need to do something with my day. So um, I'm gonna wake up Milan and well, I'm gonna try to wake him up after like my uh, past four attempts this morning, but we're gonna try and do something. Um, I'm not quite sure yet. We might go for a nice drive somewhere, a walk. I mean, it's pretty cloudy today outside. I will show you. This is what outside is looking like. Also, I hope you like my mum's fake flowers in our kitchen. Um, so yeah, we're gonna find something to do and get some food because I'm starving and we've got no bread in the house. I really wanted some toast this morning. It's not started off great for me, but yeah, I will see you in a bit. I've decided that I want some super noodles, so let's go. It's not even funny how hard this hangover is hitting me. I've literally drank loads of water this morning as well and I still feel like a horrible, I, I, mm, 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 not good. Once I've eaten my noodles, I'm gonna have a shower, get myself ready, perked up a bit, and I think we're good to go. He has finally awoken. <laughs> and he's forcing me to drive, aren't you? Mm. <laughs> so <impressed>. <laughs> <laughs> Goodbye. Here we have my beautiful super noodles. So the plan for today is we're going to get ready and we are going to better and we're going to go get pizza from there. Even though I'm sat here eating noodles now, I'm just craving like a good like stone baked pizza. I'm so excited. It seems that someone has beaten to the shower. This isn't even funny. Let me in. <laughs> so I'm all dressed. This is my outfit for today. This little top is from PLT. It's quite cute actually. Um, I had I did like a PLT order like months ago and I didn't even realize that this was sat in my wardrobe at uni. And then I picked it out and I was like, oh yeah, please don't mind my hallway. It's like, it is a building site at the moment because we're having it redone. But yeah, these trousers, I don't know where they're from. Um, because they're my mum's. But if anyone wants to know, I will find out. I'll put it in the description. And I've got my very, very dirty Air Forces on. So yeah, I'm gonna put like a tiny, weeny bit of makeup on. And then we're gonna go. So we're in the car, we're about to go. We're gonna get some petrol um, because he's low on petrol. Oh yeah, and I got him to drive. I'm just in too much of a state and then I can vlog as well. So yeah, off we go. 
go backwards. <laughs> we have some chocolate chip cookies. Thanks to this beautiful boy. And orange juice. Just walking through the train station now going up the steps we're gonna go to get pizza and i'm also trying to persuade him to get on the little train please this is the train in question oh. very sad that he won't let me go on it so we've made it to get pizza this is my first time vlogging in public, so very awkward that we are in a pizzeria. And we have both ordered Margaret's pizzas. We're sat outside right now actually, and it's very cute. I will give you a little pan round in a minute. Here he is, the man himself. And he's got a Victorian lemonade. How's your lemonade? It's okay. Is it fizzy? It's just like a cloudy one. I think so. Yeah. I'm gonna drink my orange juice that he got me earlier because I'm a cheapskate. <laughs> Here we have the pizzas. I'm very happy now. Uh oh. This pizza is so good. I've only got one slice left. Make me kind of sad, but it's getting cold, so. So, this is where we were hanging pizzeria. Um, it was quite what, how would you rate it out of ten? Seven, seven, uh, yeah, I'd give it a seven, I think. Solid, seven. solid, seven. It wouldn't go below six, no, no it wouldn't go below seven. There's, um, there's, there's no menus. No, the menu the menu is quite hard to read because it's literally like No, it's hard to find. Yeah, hard to find as well. Um and it, it's hard to read as well because it's in it's so small writing as well. But overall, we do enjoy the pizza. A lot of people go there. Yeah, quite a lot of people. As you can see it's packed. Um but what is your favourite pizza place? Comment down below. Cause I might not have been there. And I would love to try it out and I can record a video of my first impressions. But yeah, um, I think I'm going to get some ice cream now because I really want some. We are about to get ice cream. Ooh. I've got my ice cream. I decided to get strawberry. I got a double scoop tub because ice cream is one of my favourite foods. Isn't it? It's <laughs> sad what you said that. Yeah. yeah. I will stop pestering him about the little train because I really want to go on it. And he's just cold and tired. Oh. Get on the train, <laughs> is what it's saying. We're just going to sit here whilst I eat my ice cream and then I think we're going to get going. Yeah. Because my mum is making dinner. So, yeah, I'll see you when I've eaten this. Look at it. He just won't let me go on it. Bye bye train. <laughs> this is a sad day. So, we just went into that conservation gallery. It's down these steps. It's some interesting art in there, wasn't there? <laughs> I don't know how we felt about it, but look at these sculptures behind us. You're in front of the sculpture. I'm not very good at filming, am I? 
<laughs> That's all. No, I'll just turn it in <laughs> Big rhino. Looks a bit like you. Kaifa. <laughs> we're in the car and we're ready to go home. It's home time now. Um, it is a bit chilly, otherwise we probably would have gone for like a little walk as well. And it looks like it's going to rain. Um, but we had a nice time. It was nice just to get away from what we see every single day. We will see you at home. Hello. Wait, it's upside down. Hello. We are almost at the lens house. We are going there for a bit before dinner. I'm, I'm just really tired now after that drive home. the chicken coop here we have mr reginald davis he is a beauty he's absolutely massive we bloody love him with all our hearts reggie welcome to youtube say hello to everyone come on big guy <laughs> he's gorgeous oh yes you are Oh yes. <laughs> and do any of the others have any names? I think it's just Reggie that is named because we, he's just massive. Aren't you? You're a big boy. He is a big boy. But yeah, there's loads of them. How many chickens have you got roughly? A hundred. <laughs> it's actually. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so about a hundred. Should we go see the babies? Well, and I'll show you the baby chickens. Say bye, Reg. <laughs> so here are the little baby chickens. And we also have ducklings. Well, we've got two ducklings. And they've actually grown really, really fast. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Hello. Yeah. It's so funny. <laughs> this is the bigger out of the two baby ducklings. It's so pretty. So guys. Um we are just in Milan's room. Um, the tiredness has really hit me. I think I might have to have a little nap before we carry on with the day. I mean, it is about like 20 past six right now. But I think I'm just going to nap for a bit. And then when we get home, I'll have some food. And yeah, it's just going to be a, it's just gonna be a very chill evening. And here we have... I've awoken from my slumber and now it's time to go home. So here we have the pasta on the boil and my mum has made us some meatballs. Yeah. And I'm very excited for them. I love meatballs. The sauce that she does with them is beautiful also. So that is our dinner. Dinner, dinner, schmanner. <laughs> I'm just doing the pasta. Please excuse my appearance. Um, I've decided not to sort it out yet since I got up from my nap. But yeah.
I'll get you juice next time. Okay. <laughs> it is dinner time. Dinner time, yeah. Sing a dinner song. Huh? <laughs> Dinner song. Dinner song. So, change of plan. We're going on for a bit. <laughs> Hi, guys. So, we're home. Um, it's currently like half 11, I think, roundabout. Um, so, yeah, uh, we got home. We've just been sat just watching TV. Um, YouTube, TikTok, um, and I'm just gonna get in my pajamas now, wash my face, brush my teeth, get ready for bed, and we're probably just gonna watch a movie before we go to bed. But yeah, I will show you all my skincare. Well, not my skincare, just me washing my face, brush my teeth, and stuff. Now, okay, guys, I'm now in my PJs, and it's time to get this off my face. Um, brush my teeth. I'm using my uh, this stuff is actually really good. I think it's better than normal micellar water. To be honest, it works better for me because it's like in a gel form and it foams up then like a proper cleanser. Um, whereas like with micellar water, it's literally just like water. It doesn't. I don't think it foams up as well as this does because it's an actual like gel wash. But yeah, I'm just gonna go in with this on my face. Look, it's foamy. And I love it. I just find it so much easier then to get all my makeup off. Not that I've got that much on today, but still. Oh, uh, I forgot. I used, um, it's like this Maybelline mascara, but it's like a waterproof version of it. And it's so much harder to get off than the, the normal version. And now I'm gonna rinse my face. Let's go. I can't even see, Jesus. I hope this water's not too hot. Okay, I'm gonna go in with a little bit more on my lashes because that mascara is stubborn. Um, it's like, I can't remember what mascara it is, but I need to get another one of the non waterproof version because I love that mascara. So we're going in with a bit more cleanser to sort out my very stubborn eyelashes. Not eyelashes, mascara. Just like that. Ugh, can't see again. And I return back to normal state after catfishing for the whole day. Oh. Now, I'm also going to use my face wash it's like a it almost this face wash is amazing <sighs> go really nose my allergies are really hitting me at the moment it's not fun but this is the clean and clear deep action cream wash um it feels like you've got toner on your face because it tingles a bit i think it's got tea tree in it oh, it's got like salicylic acid which um i've got in my toner pads that i put on my face anyway because my pores get really clogged and i find they really help me so i don't get as many breakouts then my skin just feels a lot cleaner then because i'm toning it in two steps one of them's a bit more exfoliating with the pads so yeah, i'm just gonna put this on my face avoiding my eyes um and then the other one's like more of a soothing toner but yeah i'm just gonna put this all over the face not all over the face. I'm avoiding my eyes. I'm on my lips. That would help. But yeah, I just gotta let my it in. So it really targets the areas that I want it to, where I get most oily, especially. And I'm gonna leave that on whilst I brush my teeth. So it can work its magic. I find that it works a lot better when I leave it on for like a couple of minutes. 
when I'm doing something else, for example, brushing my teeth, that's what I usually do because it's a good like time period for me to leave it on. It's not on for too long at the same time. You can actually leave it on overnight. I have done that once or twice when my skin's been really bad. Almost like an overnight face mask. And it works wonders. It does. So, I'm just going to brush my teeth. This is my toothpaste. Call it travel action. Not that you probably can. Okay, now that I brush my teeth, I'm gonna rinse my face. As you can see, it's like settled into my face a bit more. You can't see it as much. That means it's working. I hope. Okay. My face is rinsed. Is it just me? Well, I've been watching loads of like true crime stuff, but then I've been watching like paranormal episodes of BuzzFeed Unsolved where they do ghost hunting and stuff and now I've developed like a tiny little fear of just washing my face over the sink because I'm really scared that some I'm going to see someone in the mirror behind me now record how much I'm walking and stuff and what exercise I'm doing now I'm going to put my coat back in because I literally got changed in here before as well into my pyjamas it's my room Oh, it's a mess. Let's go into the kitchen. So yeah, my house is like an absolute mess at the moment, but yeah, I think I'm gonna end the vlog here because we're not gonna be doing much more tonight. Um, Probably just going to bed. But yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you've enjoyed my first vlog. Um. I do want to do more vlogs. I need to get a proper vlogging camera because I don't know if you can tell. I film these videos on my phone at the moment, but I need to get a vlogging camera because it'll just be so much easier for me because like I'm constantly like stopping on my phone. Like we were trying to navigate today and I had to stop navigating to film something. <laughs> so I need to get an actual camera. Um, and Milan is just sat on the sofa now waiting for me, bless him. Yeah, I think we're going to watch a movie or something before we go to bed. Um, but I really hope you enjoyed it. Please give it a thumbs up if you did. And let me know what you want to see next. Because um, I've had a few suggestions here and there. But comment down below. Also comment down below what your favourite Pete's place is. I did mention that earlier in the vlog, didn't I? Because I'm trying to find out where my favourite pizza is from. So yeah. Thanks so much for watching and don't forget to subscribe. Bye.